Being in nature is awesome, but ticks are not. Hey, that's not nice. That's because they can give you Lyme disease by biting you. The good news is that you can prevent a tick bite. Deer ticks aren't easy to see. That's because they're the size of a sesame seed, or even smaller if they're a nymph, the word for young tick. They hang out in long grass, wood piles, and bushes, looking for their next meal, either an animal walking by or you. I'll have the human ankle, please. Excellent choice, madam. In order to prevent a tick bite, be tick aware. Avoid tick habitats. Ticks can't jump, but they will grab onto you if you brush by them. So try to avoid walking through fields, or if you're in the woods, try to stay on a path. Wear light-colored clothing. This makes it easier to see a tick if it's on you. If you can, wear long pants, preferably tucked into your socks, a long sleeve shirt, closed toe shoes, and tuck long hair under a hat. Apply tick repellent. They make a type for skin and a type for clothes. Use both and follow instructions. Remove clothing when you come back indoors. Running clothes in a dryer on high for 15 minutes will kill any ticks. No! If you're not at home and you find a tick on your clothes, tell an adult so they can remove it. Examine yourself for ticks every day and everywhere. Feel for bumps from head to toe. They hide in small places like your hair, behind your ears, and in your neck, armpits, between your fingers, at your waist and back, in your belly button, your private parts, behind knees, and between toes. If you find a tick on you, don't panic. An adult can remove it with tweezers or a tick removal tool. They'll want to grab it as close to the skin as possible and slowly pull straight up. It won't hurt, just pull a little. The goal is to not agitate the tick, but to remove all of the tick, including the head. Next, wash the site where the tick was attached with antiseptic. And don't touch the removed tick with your bare hands, because it could have bacteria. You'll want to send it to a testing lab to know if the tick was carrying anything like Lyme disease. Also, it helps researchers track what type of ticks are where. If possible, take a picture of where you were bit and draw a circle around the site bite to keep track of any changes. Watch for a rash. It can appear the next day or take over a week. Some people don't get a rash, but will start to feel sick, like the flu. If you start to feel sick, tell an adult. It could mean you have Lyme disease and it's important to start medication. Enjoy the outdoors and don't forget to be tick aware.